Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make 3D text just like this using 3D Max, the quick and easy way. So what you have to do first is download this template here from the link in the description. This was made by me in 3D Max. I did not download this from another website and use it. I made this myself. So open up 3D Max once you have downloaded that and then go to open and then open and open up the template here okay so it's gonna all look like this and to change the text all you have to do is click on um, the back layer and the layer in the front because there's two of them okay so what you do first is select the back one and click right here on the modify and then click right here on the text and then here you can change the text to whatever you want so Okay, and then you select this uh, other one, go to the modified tab up here, text, and then change it to whatever it said on the back. So, and there you go, now it'll match up. And then uh, to change the color and everything, you press M on your keyboard to open up the material editor. And right here you can just change it, um, or you can create a new uh, style, just select one of the gray ones, just like that, and then just choose your color, um, like that, and that's going to be for the front, you can do whatever you want, and you can also just, uh, all you have to do is drag the here to the back or whatever you want. Um, so yeah, you can edit it, the text, and change the color. Also, the background, you can click on it, press M on your keyboard again, and create a new style, maybe um, green, I don't know. And apply it to the back thing. It'll look like this, but yeah, it looks ugly. So yeah, and then also I added the lighting. So it'll show shadows like this, so it'll look more realistic, but it'll take a lot longer to render, maybe like, uh, maybe five minutes. But if you want to just render quickly and remove the lighting, just turn this thing here. You'll find this little circle thing here, just click on it like that, and then just hit delete on your keyboard, D-E-L, and it'll be gone. And then just put this back like it was you can change the view and everything um, yeah and then you just uh, to render this has an image if you don't know right here on a single well first you click here for the render setup and then this thing's gonna come up and then um, really what you just have to do is just change the dimensions for your desktop and right here on files you click there, select your format, I'll put PNG, and then the name, save, uh, I'm not going to do that right now. Okay, and then it's going to turn out like this, it's going to have save file with the checkbox checked, and it's going to have this, and then once you have the dimensions, and this here, all you have to do is click render, and it's going to uh, render out, and uh, yeah, and it's gonna take about uh, maybe one minute or less maybe like 30 seconds to render without the lighting or five to ten minutes to render with the lighting with the shadows and everything so yeah uh, the link will be in the description for the template and that's it alright bye